1907 citizens. Finally, my leave allowed me to play some more Star Citizen. Uh, and of course, I as well jumped on the big train of selling maize. And this maize can be found in the risky salvaging missions. I assume most of you guys already do know that. And here I am doing a little video about it. And here you just see me selling some stuff a bit. Being at crew L4, where you can actually sell mace. And I just got a little amount left here on the SCU. You can sell 50 SCU per time, then you have to wait about 7 minutes for the tick till you can sell it again. And you see, even this 30 SCU sell for 2.7 million. A full load of about 50 million you can sell for 4.8 million, which adds. A nice, a nice amount of money to your life. To get those missions, you go into your mobile class, you open the contracts, and on a general salvage, you find mission. I recommended you the smallest one, smallest amount of pay. You need to do about three or maybe four of them. That under personal, the risky salvage missions are coming up, and you want to take the M2 or the C2 star lifter missions when it comes to that forward you pay up between 30,000 50,000 bucks to get them and you just fly there you don't need to salvage them you don't need to do anything you just open the cargo hatch and take the cargo out and of course for the first couple of missions you actually need to go with the salvaging ship so the vulture is great in place to do that and you're ready and good to go. The ship of choice to take would be a Hercules C2 or an M2, either or you need big cargo space because you need to move around big pieces of cargo. And the most important thing to adjust is under systems. It's the quantum drive. You need a TS minus two for way, way tech. This is a military grade A. Um, size 3 quantum drive it moves you fast through the system I usually replace as well the shields just to have a little bit more of health pool in case I get under attack pick it up and enjoy the flight as you approach the ship that is salvaged or the cargo that needs to be taken out fly onto its back because you want to have as close as possible and as minimal transition space and be mindful don't punch the other ship away or it starts spinning and the whole mission will get a shit amount of more difficult to do because it won't stop spinning the ships are light, you have your tractor beam on the multi-tool and you open the hatch of the other ship and as soon as you tractor in you can see in the bottom text what it actually is and you need to decide whether you want to load it over onto your ship or throw it out. Boras is sort of on the edge, you could take it, you couldn't, depends what you want, it depends how much space you are actually having. Overall this is not as good run as it could be. We really look for mace because mace will pay out really well as you've seen in the beginning as again 50 SU of mace will give you 4.8 million AUAC. All the other drugs, Widow, um, Slam and the uh, Apo thing whatever adds as well to your payments um, but best is definitely mace slam will be second and the others yeah just gives you additional credits to fill up some space in your ship but look for mace and of course you need to make sure your hole is safe and sound on your ship but here's an important thing do not stack items too much and especially don't stack 
different kind of containers on top of each other or you won't be able to sell them well even worse it's not only you won't be able to sell them you will be able to sell them but you won't get any money for it you will get an error message and the error message says said um, problems by unloading the cargo and the potential 4.8 billion million that you want to have will not appear in your account but the hole will be gone so if you stack your stuff up only the same kind of motive of aura commitment uh, commitment <laughs> commodity that you are actually having on top of each other okay and as you see first i do usually a big mess i just throw everything in then i enter the ship and um closing my uh back door of the c2 and then i start stacking it And as soon as we stacked up everything nicely and perfectly, we fly over to crew L4 out onto the station that sort of resembles us to Port Olizar. Well, slightly smaller, but the same annoying big rings around where you need to squeeze your ship in between onto it. In the station itself, you need to store your ship in order to be able to sell. Basically the same procedure as every other station, but here is important, you don't need to go to the admin. You need to go to the selling kiosk at the lockers. To find that, you go up to Galleria. And as you arrive there, You turn in the first left up these weird little stairs on to the left hand side there is the locker area and on the very end you find another player selling as well which is a pity now the big battle starts Zip. let's sneak in ah oh, he leaves lucky one and then we see what we can sell. First you need to choose the ship where you have the stuff on it. And then you see what we all get. So we have a lot of stuff here. We don't have a lot of mace on that run. So you see the at 3C whatever gives you about 50k's for what we have. We have a quite some slam here. So we sell the max stuff and you see it's 765,000. Um, AOAC 4 slam, a full stack, 50 stack of 50, which is an okay price. And again, Mace will pay you for 50 SCU, about 4.8 million. Okay. So we keep on selling that. And then there is this, we have to wait. There is this tick for 7 minutes till we actually can sell again. So we need to wait or you need to switch servers. That depends on how you want to move with that and here you're gonna see a full load of mace well fifth how to sell 50 su i came in with 167 i think so we put the infinity you see the price 4.5 million aoac for 50 su of mace and of course we are very happy with that and there is a big 07 to everybody watching this video if this was helpful please like and subscribe comment in the comments if there is anything to add i missed something or recommendations and suggestions that you're having i'm always gladly hearing about that and i wish you a very prosperous time in 320 and i really look forward 4, 3, 20, 1.
and the weird occurrences like this guy here well <laughs> i'm loving it see you the worst star citizen have a beautiful time